Hey everybody, this is the Apple reseller here, back with another video. Today I'm going to be sh doing a video showing you guys how you can fix your own MacBook trackpad if it's loose or unresponsive. Now what I mean by loose, I mean like when you click on the trackpad if it's really loud or if it feels like it has a lot of travel when you click on it. And responsive, I mean by if you click on your trackpad and it doesn't respond or if it only respond when you click it really hard. So to fix your trackpad, you're going to need two things. You're going to need a tri-wing screwdriver. As you can see here, see here, this is a tri-wing. Uh, you, you probably can't see that too well, but basically you need a tri-wing screwdriver and a Phillips screwdriver, just a regular Phillips screwdriver. Now this method will work on unibody MacBook and MacBook Pro from 2008 to 2012. I'm not sure if this works on MacBook Airs and MacBook Pro Retina, but comment below and let me know if it works on those or not. So the first thing that you want to do is to turn your MacBook over on its back as you can see I have done here. Now, this is a late 2008 MacBook, which has a removable cover, as you can see. This is the same for the late 2008 MacBook Pro. However, if you have a 2009 to 2012 MacBook or MacBook Pro non-retina, then you will have to take out 10 Phillips screw. It will be like these Phillips screw right here, except there will be 10 of them all around the cover. So you will need a Phillips screw to take them out. But if you have a late 2008 MacBook or MacBook Pro, you can just take off the cover with this switch as you can see here. You just flip the switch and the cover comes out. Then you will need to remove the battery, which you just pull up and the battery comes out. Now this is the screw that you will want to focus on. As you can see, it is a tri-wing screw. So you will need a tri-wing sc screwdriver to turn this screw. I can show you guys right here. This tri-wing screwdriver like this. Now if your trackpad is loose and unresponsive, you will want to turn your screw clockwise. So you turn it to the right until it's tight enough but not too tight. You can just like check that it still clicks. Just go under the trackpad and just tap on it. As you can see, this one clicks well and it's not too loose. But if you over tighten the screw, then the trackpad will not click at all. Then just turn it count counterclockwise a little bit until you get that click. So that's how you can fix your own trackpad. So that's going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys find this video helpful. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.